And when the water gets that cold, you won't find me in it, Andy. And another, again Good. tonight, we're going to be down around freezing. And I saw that story and I checked with a friend of mine who works over in Beaumont where they've got alligators as well. He says the gators in East Texas, they burrow down into the mud oh, there and uh. keep from uh, being too terribly cold. Tonight, clear skies for us, but we do anticipate clouds on the increase. Live look from our standard insurance Sky Live weather camera. It's a beautiful evening. We've got some changes coming in the next couple of days here. Uh, they promise maybe a sprinkle or two on Saturday morning. Otherwise, just a big cool down on the way for us. We've got a front that's made its way through here right now. It's going to start doubling back tonight and tomorrow, producing cloud cover across our region, some rain across deep south Texas, and maybe a couple of sprinkles for us on Saturday. Most of the rain is going to stay well to the south of us, so I don't see a big rain threat to ruin your weekend. We already see clouds on the increase here locally, although nothing that's producing any precipitation. We're going to go with a cloudy sky forecast late tonight. Light freeze, temperature down to about 30 in the morning with a light east wind around 10 miles an hour. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies. We'll start out with some sunshine in the morning. Mix it up a little bit and then more clouds and sunshine in the afternoon. High should make it back up to around 51. Those winds working their way around to the northeast and then to the southeast by tomorrow evening, beginning at least a little bit of a warming trend force. 60 was the high today in Grosbeck, Limestone County weather watcher there is Debbie Fulmer and Copper Scove Dick Bonheim checking in with 61 degrees and one of the warmer readings around the area. Lamp passes Joe Spivey at 63 degrees, the high temperature there. 44 now in Waco after a high of 64, 45 in Marlin and in Temple, 44 in Colleen right now. Gatesville reporting 43 degrees. We've got cloudy skies from 44 at the airport. Calm winds, 68% relative humidity. So temperatures aren't going to get real cold for us tonight, but they'll be right down close to the freezing mark in many locations. Out to the west, around 31, 32 degrees. Up and down the I-35 corridor, probably 32 to 33 degrees. And then as you get over towards uh, I-45, temperatures are slightly warmer. We'll go 34 in College Station, 35 in Bryan and Franklin, but 31 degrees the overnight low tonight down in Fairfield with sunshine limited tomorrow. I should get back up into the low 50s. It looks like here's your channel 6 7 day forecast where your weekend is always in view. Cool night tonight. Clouds on the increase 30. The low 51 your high temperature on Friday. Your weekend doesn't look too terribly bad. Maybe an increase in cloud cover, possibly a few sprinkles on Saturday. I don't see any reason to cancel any of your honeydews this weekend. 57 should be the high Saturday You're up to 63 on Sunday. Another front coming our way Monday evening. It looks like. In the meantime, we'll go with a slight chance of a shower on Monday afternoon and Monday evening, then a little cooler on Tuesday. We'll have complete details of the forecast coming up tomorrow morning on Texas Today. Sports is next. Stay with us.